All right, so it's our first trip, 2023. We're heading off to Athens, Greece. Woohoo! Welcome to our Airbnb here in Athens, Greece. We're located in the Pragati district, uh, pretty much the central of Athens. It's easy walk to get around to everything that we want to see. So let me show you around the Airbnb. Uh, it is two bedrooms, one bath, and it's pretty spacious. So one of my favorite features here are these blackout shutters that are automatic. So here, let me show you how they work. You just hit a button and they just come down. It's like so nice. And it just blacks out the apartment. They have them in each of the bedrooms. So not only do you feel like extra safe, you can sleep in so whenever you want. <laughs> so we're paying about 70 euros a night here and I feel like you get this like very luxurious apartment for that. It's wonderful. We have the kitchen and a very important fact about the kitchen for me is this combo washer and dryer. So when we're on the road, a lot of times we are only traveling with a carry on. So that means I've got to have three weeks of outfits, three weeks of outfits in a carry on very hard so i love to have a washing machine and dryer this apartment came with a combo dryer doesn't work as well as a separate dryer but it gets the job done and i'm very happy with it one of the things i love about this kitchen is this fridge a lot of times your european refrigerators are somewhat smaller not this one and i love the layout of it it's just easy to put things in of course you have a wine rack a wine rack in your fridge i love it uh, easy to store things. And I also like that it's kind of tall. You're not like bending over too much. We haven't really used the freezer, but it's been nice, accessible. I really do like this fridge. And everything else we like to cook when we're here. So everything else, we have a dishwasher, stove. It works wonderfully. Uh, this is the guest bedroom. We only really use the guest bedrooms for work because we do work when we are away uh, for this amount of time. So the, the bedroom here serves as basically an office, but it's very nice, spacious. I love in this apartment, especially the devils in the details with the wonderful closet space. Did it very well as far as making sure that you have space for your belongings, for your clothes, you can hang everything up, there's drawers, and it, it was very nicely done. <sighs> this is where all the magic happens. Like like sleep, a lot of it, it's just, we, it's sleep, we sleep here. <laughs> and again, it has a nice uh, exit for a balcony, but you know, just a hit of the button and we're blackout and can sleep again till whenever we want. <laughs> or until we have to start our work. <laughs> so let me show you the bathroom. The bathroom. The bathroom is a little tight, but like I said, it was very nicely done as far as the details of everything that you need. Uh, the shower is amazing. Hot water all the time. If you travel to Europe, you know sometimes showers might not be as powerful as what you're used to, maybe in the United States, but this is hot water, it's powerful, and I love it. Then there's a secret to to this apartment that I absolutely, some people may think it's weird, but I think it's incredibly smart. So walk back with me into the bathroom to find this window. Hi. So you might think this is weird, but it's not weird. This is the shower. So if my husband's in the shower,
shower and he needs a cup of coffee and I'm in the kitchen, I can just pass it right to him. Easy peasy, so great. So let's talk food. When you first get to Athens, you're probably gonna be really tired from all of the traveling it took to get here. I know how that feels. We traveled almost 24 hours with our layover in Rome. We were so tired, but we were also hungry when we got here and we just didn't feel like going out to get something to eat. So we looked up the delivery services that they have here. There's two apps that you can deliver from that we found. One was eFood and the other one was walt.com. eFood, we had a problem with getting the access code. They were supposed to text you a code so you can start using the app. We could never get the code. So I logged on to walt.com through my laptop and that worked seamlessly. It was awesome. The food, because we've used it a couple of times, the food comes so fast, way faster than what they tell you it's gonna be. Oh dear! It's hot, it's fresh, and I have to say, souvlaki is my new favorite dish. It's delicious, I love it. Thank you, Greece. So one other thing that we like to do when we first get to a new city is understand the layout of the city. And there's no better way to do that than getting a walking tour from a local. So we hopped on to Airbnb experiences and I found a new friend, Effie, who took us on a historic walking tour of the streets of Athens. So our walking tour with Effie was exactly what we needed to understand the layout of the city. It was great, she was fantastic. I'll leave a link of everything I talked about in the description below, so if there's anything you wanna get connected to, it'll be there. So I hope you enjoyed this video, but it's time. You gotta go. So, until next time. Oops, sorry, I'm still trying to get used to this door. Okay. Bye.